Welcome back to Jackie Chan's Action Kung Fu, and we're finishing the game this time. So basically, hey guys, are you ready for a boss rush? Oh, yeah, sure, really why really not? not to... Surprisingly, it's not a boss rush of the previous bosses we fought. It's a boss battle where we're gonna find this uh, various recallers of the same dragon. Huh. Time to rock yeah. the dragon. This dragon fires fireballs, as you can see. So basically what you do is go to the... Uh, do this pattern that I'm doing right now. If, just keep doing this over and over, and, an you'll, arc, uh, yeah. and, you, and you'll be able to beat it easily. Just look like a Ridley boss fight. It there does you go. look a bit like Ridley. And every time you beat one of them, you get at the very least a frog that gives you something, at the very least. Oh. Unfo unfortunately, only one of them is an actual bull. So Here's the problem with these bosses. In order to defeat these bosses, you have to know in advance how they're designed, what's the best pattern to go, because newcomers are gonna have a fucking nightmare. Because a lot of these- Try and error. Because yeah, I, I, don't think, I don't think newcomers will bother playing this game, though. Or, or arrive at this point, at the very least. Actually, yeah. this game was uh, significantly successful for Hudson Soft back in the day, so a lot of people did play this game back in the day. Oh. And um, I guess Chucky Chan, at, at least back in the day, was a brand that could sell just by name alone. Yeah, like th yeah that's why they made a TV show about him. This is it, there's another Jackie Chan Adventures, which has nothing to do with the original series. It's only Jackie Chan Adventures by name. Alright, so that one that threw the ice, that one was uh, one of the harder ones, because the pattern, as you guys could see, was not exactly... Ugh, sorry. It's not, it's not exactly like the most, you know, easy to tell. However, fortunately, you got a bull after, so that's nice. Alright, this next one, if I remember correctly, it's a green one right now, isn't it? Uh, yeah, the... Yeah, the green one. The green one is... is yeah, he throws oh, jumping bounce. balls, oh. bouncing balls. Oh no, look out, Teo! It's inheritance! <laughs> so, here's what you do. Try to do something... Oh no, it's made of jade. Basically, yeah. Like, the problem is that uh, he throws his balls quite quickly, as you can see, so it's really hard to... Yeah. To just try your best to get through, basically. Yeah, let's try that again. That Trust me, because this is an entire boss rush, you have to do it with just one ball. Trust me. You cannot afford to get hurt too much in one of these dragons, because you're gonna have to fight, like, more after this. Trust me. This is one of those cases where, like, uh, you have to either, you know, become a, a, a Jackie Chan master, or just abuse the fuck out of safe states. Or if you became a Jackie Chan master by abusing the hell out of safe states. <laughs> Let's try that yeah, again. That, 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 you, know, you know, that should be the, uh, that should be, that should have been this game's fuck. subtitle. Jackie Chan saves states. <laughs> get it? Because he, he, he likes to save yes, states. Yes, don't explain the joke. We, we, we get it, we get it. Don't, don't, don't have hey. to explain the joke. Yeah. I mean, it's better than, um, Better than some other ones I had in mind. There we go. There we go. Fucking hell, man. Jackie Chan, uh... Alright, whatever, next. Chibi, Chibi Chan. Echo. Chibi Chan, that's Alright. Um, let's see, yeah, let's go with this. I only have four bits of life, but should okay. be good enough. If I ever listen to this soundtrack on its own, Perfect. now I will. Now I'm always going to imagine it. Here's oh, what. You, here's what you do. You, are, page or opens the same you have to stand That's on the, on this exact same spot that I'm standing in, and the thing will not. And even then, you still have to properly time the times you jump, uh, and hurt them. So again, this is one of those cases where you have to know in advance exactly uh, how the boss works. That's uh, like litter. How it, unfortunate. That's what I was gonna say. It looks like he's shooting acid rain at you. Fuck. Acid no, rain. De def definitely looks litter. Yes, that just some stay out while others feel the pain. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> if you guys say here, it, it just circles about. There you go. You have to try your best to get into a groove where you, you, you always jump uh, in exactly when the ball leaves an opening. There you go. Like that. Trust me, this is. Trust you, I'm making this. Right now, I'm making this look easier than it is. Oh, out Jesus' name. Heavy rain. No, no, The kid's back and will never be the same. Heavy rain. The PS3 still has no games. Heavy rain. Wow, that joke is so outdated. Whatever, the point is. In 2010, that joke was old. 
Okay, so yeah, basically, trust me, I'm, I made that look easier than it is because it was, no, it, it, was, it still was not. Uh, okay, I can't believe it was not. All right, uh, final dragon, the golden one. Which oh, not a blue, not, all right, we faced the blue dragon before. What a shame. The blue dragon was the first. What's well, so the second one too? Mm -hmm. so. Yeah. And now we're gonna fight the golden dragon, who fights, who sends mini dragons uh, after us. The fiend. Woo. Fucking hell. Uh, and allow me to remind everybody, after this golden dragon, we're gonna fight the final boss. Yeah. So yeah, this level... Well, this level not under the river. This is still the final part of the final level because we still have to fight all our way to back here. So basically, everybody, if you want to beat this final level, you have to do all of this crap. We've just one continue. Have fun. Beautiful. Okay, 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 okay. I'll, never, I'll actually never mind. Like, okay, never mind. Now, if you use a continue, um, you'll start back at the beginning of these dragons. But that's it. That that's the last checkpoint. You cannot say you don't have any checkpoints after the dragons. You have to go through all five of these dragons and the final boss, both of its forms. Um, Don't tell me there's a secret good ending as well. No, no, there's only one ending. There's no multiple endings. Because that would be such a uh, that would be such a Japanese game dev thing to that's, do. That's that's something more like what Konami would make. Because Konami or Capcom with Ghost and Goblins. So. True. I experienced that the hard way. Ah, <laughs> uh, good Fuck. old ghosts and goblins. Fucking dragons. All right. <laughs> That's dragons, it's, it's, Pedro. It's ghosts and goblins, not dragons. Get it right. <laughs> oh, hi, Mr. Old Man, and bye, Old Man. Um, uh, was Were you supposed to get I, on this uh, cloud? Yeah, that's so he usually takes you to, to bonus levels, but, you know, that's the thing. That's the thing, Teo. I, 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 trust me, I've tried jumping on that cloud. It doesn't work. Okay. Anyway, now you have to beat the fucking wall that wants to kill you, apparently. <laughs> Too easy. Yeah, this is uh, okay. Yeah, yeah. Like Jova said, this is actually pretty easy. Just keep punching. There you go. So oh. I'm not the nostalgia critic, you morons. There's a little for Chetty's man. Uh, what? what? He, re he reviewed Pink's Poison the Wall there, Pedro. Oh, I okay. See. Oh, okay. All right. right. Now he's explaining the junk. <laughs> well, uh, well, in this case, I didn't get it, so it made sense for him to explain it. Anyway, yeah, let's fight Mr. Whoever he is, because the, the uh, I mean, he really looks like a Dolphin Chain. Maybe his, maybe uh, basically that. Jackie Chan versus Largo. Maybe his name is written in the manual. Fans of this game, please send your, please send whoever his, whatever his name is to. Although, uh, I don't give a shit. Uh, uh, yeah, Gmail dot com. Although it's a better fight, it's a, it's a better fight against Largo than the one in front of the ball. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. There you go. There and you go. they turns into a spider and goes away. And runs away. Well, of course. <laughs> okay. If 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 Argo could do that. And here you go. Really? When you meet when you meet back your sister, she heals your life uh, a bit. But now you have to go because there's oh. a second phase to this final boss. Oh, of course. Well, remember he just turned into a spider. Now we must exterminate the spider. Don't tell me that the old man turns out to be the final boss. The final... Oh, no, no, there you go, there you go, Till. I'm guessing that's what the cloud was going to be for. Oh, what the fuck? As for your question, Till, no, the old man is completely pointless. He's just there. <laughs> to give you... Is the that to be your Also, to Jova, you enjoy, enjoy your arachnophobia, I guess. So there you go, everybody. Never thought you'd see this. Jackie Shan on top of a flying cloud fighting a giant spider. <laughs> why not? Why not? <laughs> Sky's the limit, we don't give a shit. <laughs> Ah, skies. Flying Man, Shen, Shen Du, you really let yourself go. <laughs> <laughs> I love, oh, I love, lovely. I you destroy each leg. The more damage you do. It's uh, it's uh, censored violence too. It's it's just uh, non-violent enough so to to not get uh, controversial at least. Not just that. It's a spider. It's okay to be. Oh man, you destroyed when you when you only had four legs. We'll let gravity do the rest. Sure. And yeah, that's it. Be helpful. Wait, where's the body? Yeah. We haven't seen it. Time to make a sequel, Jonah. <laughs> Ah, yes, I ma the I'm, I am Master, you are completely pointless. The magnificent hey, cherry blossoms of San Francisco. 
Oh. So the seasons are passing. What is going uh, on? Uh, what Jackie, is this mega? What, I forgot, uh, what Jackie, mega man game Jackie, had the? Jackie, did you leave your sister away? Now there she is. So, uh, oh. well, I forgot what mega man game had the uh, rock going through the seasons the uh, in the credits. End. Uh, I think that may have been Mega Man 7 credits. Uh, wait, so wait, it took Jackie Chan all year to walk a bit to his sister. <laughs> yes. He was very tired. But... Oh, what like the a, fuck? Alright, this, this credit's actually pretty cheeky because the developers put themselves their own faces on some of these creatures here. Don't you see? They were just in costume for the acting here. It was all smokes and mirrors and special effects, my friend, as we filmed this game. It's like, like Super Mario Bros. 3. It's like, it's like what Sagira Miyamoto wanted for GoldenEye 007. Shake Bond to shake the hands of all the guys he shot. <laughs> <laughs> this, uh, if I remember correctly, these the, uh, the credits in the NES version are not like this. Um, this was something that they did for the, for the uh, PC Engine version. If I remember correctly, it's been a while, but I've, I remember the credits in the NES version just being very typical and not not that. Uh, all right. Um, and oh, there he is. Who are you? He's the sound guy, Teo. M. Mayokawa. Who... And he's just jumping back and forth. And Jackie yeah. just kicked oh. the shit out of the sound guy. <laughs> <laughs> Why would you do that? Well, I mean, uh, actually, no, 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 no. graphics oh, by T okay. Nagayama. The hell is this game? Uh, <laughs> well, at the very least, these credits show that the developers, at the very least, were having fun making it. It seems. Yeah, you're cheeky. If only they weren't even so cruel. T Ura. Ooh. Presented by Hudson Soft. Now a Konami company. Yep. Records of your childhood. Unless it was Bonk. Which I, which it means I guess we technically own this game by now. Or does the DXD license has expire or something? Alright, and now here's the NES version. Oh my god, that looks like Princess Leia. Yeah, that doesn't look like Jackie Chan at all. Also, the title looks like something oh Okay, we'll say this, for NES quality, it's still a bit above average, uh, the average uh, sprites. Uh. Why does the villain look completely different in this version? Well, to be fair, I don't think his look would have translated that well to the 8-bit system, which had a lot less pixels to work with. That so I can see why they would have made some changes here and there to... Oh, know, look, Master, uh, you've gotten... You, you've gotten thin. Um... <laughs> Uh, what the hell happened? There you go. Um, so yeah, uh, Jackie Chan in this version doesn't look anything like Jackie Chan, as you can see. It looks like Krillin with hair. Yeah, that's one of the big reasons why I wanted to just do the the PC Engine version, because not only because that version is as a very distinct lack of exposure compared to this one, and I just find it better because it not just because it looks better, but because Jackie actually looks like Jackie. You know, the, the fucking title character, you know? So... In terms of difficulty, is this better, worse, or just Same like thing. Uh, this level design okay. is, the level design is mostly the same, and the... It, it, it's, it's basically the same game, really. Like, uh, the, the, the Turbo Graphics version did make some slight minor changes, but they're negligible in the grand scheme of things. See, we still have the bonus level with the trippy visuals. Um, just without this derangeable symbolism, because Nintendo was afraid of that. Yeah, that's another thing. The Turbo Graphics version is uncensored. That's another thing. The PC Engine version is not censored, so that's also a plus. You don't bounce on the cloud in this version. No. Again, my guess is too when they got around to making the the, the PC Engine port, they figure, okay, let's see what we can improve. Most likely, for one, let's make Jackie actually look like Jackie. That will be a plus. So. So Oops. yeah, so yeah, the NES version, while perfectly serviceable, I would argue that um, it's definitely an inferior version. Not just in terms, not just because of the looks. Uh, it, it's it, I just think um, I, I just think they did a better job with the Turbo with the PC Engine version in terms of uh, in terms of just making it overall uh, a more appealing package. 
Whereas this one looks very generic in the way in the way it is, really. Oh. The frog is very small in this version. There you go. And there's a tiger, of course. Oh yeah, this is one move one move that I actually didn't manage to get on my on my the run. Somersault. Appa yeah, apparently Jackie can like fly. Uh... Yeah, Jackie learned the screw attack from Samus. Um, yeah. Hey, that Jackie Jam guy stole my idea. <laughs> All right, so let's check out. Uh, if I remember correctly, I'm gonna get to the first boss at least, since that's oh, one, what the one, hell? that's one of the more different ones. That's the thing too. Some of the enemies are different in this version. I can see that. Yeah, I, I don't even know what the hell that thing is. Like those are flying nunchucks. Why are why is a nunchuck why is flying? It green? Oh, never mind. This thing is a. Oh, oh. I, I get it. Someone in the vase or bars, where you're going to pronounce it, just rolls them and then throws at you. Of uh, course. It's fully conveyed, I will have to say. He is one of, of the course. Best How silly throwers. of me. Okay. Yeah, it's on me. It's, it's really poorly conveyed. Reminds me of that time when I broke Pedro's mind by showing him how to school that boss in Sonic Pocket Adventure. <laughs> well, that 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 was a long yeah. Um. Well, yeah, well, excuse me, Joe, for not realize that you cannot jump on top of explosions. Like seriously. <laughs> oh look, an Pedro explosion! Oh oh look. Oh look, an explosion! I'm gonna try jumping to it and use it as a platform, because that's logical. <laughs> and yet, it worked magically. I, mean, yeah. I guess the first process would be the impact propels a Sonic towards up. Maybe. Okay, okay. My thought process was that it looks pretty much exactly like how that boss in Hydrocity works, just replace the water with fire, and lo and behold, it worked. Wow. The scroller looks much faster here. Yeah, but it's it's one thing to jump on a um, on water, it's another thing to jump on fucking fire. So I'm I so swear, this 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 theme is giving me Splash Woman vibes. Well, yeah. Um, again, this is classic NES stuff. Again, I wouldn't be surprised if this is one of the games that Sean Valesco uh, played back in the day. Um, so yeah, there you go. This is this particular bit was made a bit more interesting in the PC Engine version because there's a, there's more moving platforms, whereas in here it's just still platforms, you know. So yeah, the level design was definitely improved. I mean, mm. both ga both games are incredibly hard, so don't even try and think. Well, maybe this one's easier. No, they're both equally hard. Uh, this one even more so, arguably, because the f the first boss in this in, in in this version can actually hurt you. So there you go. So the first boss in this version. Uh, you have to jump on the platforms to get to its head instead of jumping on its ends. And it and its ends actually hurt you this time, whereas in the the PC Engine version, I guess somebody in the development team thought this first boss was way too hard. I don't know. There we go. Oh. Ah. Yeah. Um, Oh, actually over. It, it's over. It's actually over, Dad. Okay. Oh, so apparently... Oh, by the way, he survived. Uh, he survived this. But, uh, all right, Final Fantasy. So that was so. Jackie yeah. Chan's action kung fu. Go ahead, Whips. Okay. Uh, well, I mean, uh, I like the music. Mm -hmm. And, you know, the graphics of both the PC Engine version and the NES version are very good. Well, it looks hard as balls, though, so it's not really... Something I uh, go after myself. Dwibs, Hudson Soft, Hudson Soft, Dwibs. Uh, Jova, believe it or not, I actually know Hudson Soft already. I know, I know, I know. I'm just, you know, referring. <sighs> just get used to their difficulty. Uh, yeah, yeah. But I'm sure I'll um, I'll, I'll remember that next time I. Please will remember I'll that. Buy them. But um, yeah. I mean, overall, I mean, if it's fine. But um, I mean, it looks fine anyway. But it's not so fine. It's not something I play, even though I do like Jackie Chan. <laughs> mm -hmm. All right. Um, as for me, yeah, it, it, the game is it, the game is uh, is uh, good on a basic sense. It's not like it's like unfair necessarily. It's just fucking. It's just fucking fucking ball punching all the way through because it's just not very. There are times where it does get merciful, like the first boss, 
but those bits are too far in between because most of the time the game is really the game is creative enough with the way it uses uh, inspiration of Chinese and Japanese culture at least so that's nice you can tell there was effort put into it and the music is really good like we've said so yeah there's that um, it's just one of the so if you love art as balls NES platform or, or, or like old school platformers here's one for you uh, Jova yeah, I mean, it looks like a fun and quirky game. Both versions of the game look fine and fun, though. Obviously, the 16-bit one has quite a few advantages up its sleeves here and there. Yeah, it seems like a fun and quirky venture. I would say that it could use some modernizing with giving you better checkpoints at the very least and more opportunities to recover your health and, who oh, that boss rush is something fierce. But otherwise, it looks like a perfectly fine game for its time. Okay, too. This looks okay. Nothing more to me. It's, uh, unless you're a real fan of Jackie Chan, I wouldn't really touch it. Um, because it's a platform, it's a platform that's specifically designed to be hard and against you. We need to invest a lot of time and effort. Unlike with stuff with, like, say, Ghost and Goblins. I mentioned, there's not much here to convince me to enjoy this outside of, you know, being fan service towards Jackie Chan, which unfortunately I'm mean, not really. So it's it's okay, but it, I'm pro but you know, not for everyone. That's it. Well, the, I can say this: the Turbo 2016 as HPC engine version really does look on par, and it's part of that the kind of wave that uh, you know span across games where. They decided to make a game based on real people with very awkward photorealistic, uh, like satire like faces on them. Um, but anyway, that, that's it. Uh, Edge, I guess. Uh, Edge, what do you think? It's a game, it exists. Okay. Uh, <laughs> uh, it's an interesting concept. And I can understand why it was made. I feel like it's a game that can only be made. For its time. True. Mm hmm. Because who, who wants to play as a video game where you play as a real life person in a wor fantasy world? Unless it's a WWE or a 2K game. I don't know. Did I can you think that... of a lot of cases where that would still sell well today. Same. All right. Uh, All right so so uh, that I guess was. We'll see you for whatever. Whatever. Yeah. Some, some soft game. Well, I maybe, guess. Maybe, yeah. ad maybe Adventure Island. Alright, see ya. Yeah.